Hi right, guys, welcome back to more PS5 Master League. Today we're at the Reebok Stadium to take on Bolton. Away from home. I think we drew here last season, warm one if I remember. So uh yeah, Bolton, they've been down and they've been back up again. So uh today we gotta do what we can to uh to win this one and continue on. Manchester United, I think, are at home today. They're taking on uh, Everton, if I remember correctly. Casillas is in goal today, other than Czech. Uh, now, Czech had a really good game, and he's on high form today. However, he needs a rest because he's got a little bit of fatigue, and stamina's a bit of an issue. But uh, Mutu and um, Eto both on red form today up front. Uh, Fabregas is also on red form which is uh, really good um, and yeah Mafio's on red form Chavi's on good form so he's in the uh, centre of midfield with uh, Gerard. Um, who else is in there today um, yeah I think at the back we've got Colaccini and here's Eto oh I went for it uh, we've got Colaccini and Chivu we've also got uh, Sergio Ramos and Risa and the left and right back well uh, right and left back there Sergio Ramos is at his right back position and Risa is at his left so yeah that's uh, pretty much it today so yeah maybe a few changes in there slightly there's a lot of the players on good form today so hoping for a good match from us and uh, here's Mutu and he tries to put Eto in which he does and it's Eto oh and that's unfortunate booted up the field here here's Chavi and it's Mutu yes 1-0 good start good good start Top goal scorer in the league. I think he's got eight goals already. So I think that's his ninth actually in the league this season. But um, him, Pal, Ronaldo all doing pretty well. So yeah. Got to ask a little bit of a favour off Everton today. If they can get a result against United at Old Trafford. But I uh, guess we'll see the results soon. And we're off again. Reminds me that uh, Pez United still haven't picked up a point yet. They're against um, 15th placed uh, Aston Villa, I believe, today. So, uh, yeah. And they're only on, like, one point, I think, or something like that. So, <laughs> a little bit of a clash at the bottom today. Mafio's going to chase after that one, but doesn't get there. Booted back up the field here. Here's Chivu to Risa. Really hard fought victory in the last one against Chelsea. Got to keep it going today if possible. Here's Gerard. He's offside. Only just offside, I think. The, oh. oh, well. Rough boots out. Fadiga is on the left wing for uh, Bolton today. Fabregas. Playing today against the team he went out on loan to. Which uh, helped Bolton stay up last season. And that's pretty good, but uh, Chavi's been brought down there. There was a good opportunity to maybe put Eto in there as well, so that's a bit unfortunate. Here's Fabregas. Here's Eto. It's Mafio. It's Chavi again. He's brought down another free kick given away. And it's going to be Mutu to take it. And it's uh, deflected. And out for a corner. Gerard takes it. Whips it into the box. Oh, nobody there to it. Bit unlucky that one. the field is Mafio Gerard Fabregas is Eto it's Gerard once more it's Fabregas or it's Fadiga out wide though Sergio Ramos will try to come back and stop him which uh, he doesn't do the ball is in but Chivu is there to it first and it's Eto and Gerard, and it's back with Eto. And he tries to whip it into the box to Mutu, but he can't do that. Oh, and that's uh, not a very good 
ball into the box there. Chavi, it's Fabregas. Oh, he's only slightly off, you know. Unlucky. It's uh, looking pretty sharp today. Needs to get himself some more goals, though. That's for sure. It's Fabregas. He tries to put Eto in there. And Gotti will clear that up. Booted back out. Here's Ramos. Gerard to Eto. Oh, he's trying to put Fabregas in. Nakata. And uh, it's back with Mutu. Fabregas. Mafio. Here's Chavi, but he's not going to get to it. Hunt's faster. Oh, but he's going to stop that one. <laughs> and uh, it's a foul against Bolton, that, in the end. It's Chavi again. It's Fabregas. Oh, unlucky again. Playing a bit of a high line here, though, but it's working pretty well to win the ball back. Here's Gerard. It's Gerard. Oh. It's Fabregas. It's Gerard once more. He doesn't find Sergio Ramos there. Oh. Oh. <laughs> okay, maybe not then. It's very unlucky from us. I think we need we need to get that second goal. We need to get it pretty soon, I reckon. And uh, that's a foul by Ramos. Oh, but that's good. Here's Mafio. It's Eto. Oh, he's tend and got it. And it's Eto. Goes for the shot. It's Mutu, but he's offside. It was a good uh, chance by Eto. That not bad from him. Shame he didn't get the goal. It's back up. Gerard. And there, that's half time. That is very unfortunate. We did not get a second goal there. Got to press on. And we're off yet again. Come on, we've got to find the second goal. And just feels like if we get it, that'll be it. It'll just see the game out from there, pretty much. Here's Chavi. And he's going to go right back there. Is Mafio. Some good one touch passing here, but need to make something of it. Back up the field. Chivu. Gerard. He's brought down. And uh, that was the most terrible free kick. So whoever oh, whoever was there was uh Moving out of the way, and it's Fadiga, but Mafio is quicker. Risa boots it up the field. It's not a bad ball, that either. And uh, here's Mutu. And he tries to find Fabregas. Kaku. Oh, that's really bad, but Casillas gets down to it. That was lucky. Oh, and that's bad as well, but Casillas again called upon it. It's Colaccini. It's Risa. And that's a much better ball, that. And, uh... That's all right. It's a good effort. Oh, from Chavi, that...
And a nice uh, cut out by Chiru there. And he's running down the wing. Not normally you see him do this. They're going to send on Doof and McCann. Just try and change things up for them. And uh, Chivo's going to be the one to take it as well. He's going to whip it into the box, but it's going to be a foul against us. I don't know what we did there, actually. I didn't see that, but oh well. And uh, Mafio is there. I tell you what, he's had a great game, Mafio. Been stopping the ball in certain areas and winning it back for us. His Doof. And it's come back to Nolan and it's blocked out and it's Doof again. And is he going to go wide? He will to Hun. It's into the box. Oh, but Casillas is there again. And we've really got to get the second goal because I feel like they could get one if we're not careful. And we aren't being too careful at the moment. It's out to McCann. And it's stopped by Gerard. Oh, only for a split moment though. Here's McCann again. And Chivu deals with it. It's going to be a Bolton corner. This is getting a little bit too much. They're sending on Giannakopoulos now. It's into the box, but the header is away. But it's Duf again. And here he is, and Chivu cuts it out. Duf has gone down, but there's nothing given. It's out of play, and I think that's our goal kick. And Chivu has got an injury. He's played really well today. Well, we're going to make some changes then. I was going to bring on John for um, Chivu then with that injury. However, I've decided not to. I've decided to put Sergio Ramos in the centre-back position and bring on Cafu because Cafu is on form. Uh, Eto has gone off for Henri and Fabregas has gone off for uh, Joe Cole. So those are the changes. And a ball into the box is going to be... Oh, it's going to hit the bar, of all things. I thought it was going to be the corner, but I guess not. So, yeah, those are the changes. Oh, nice one by Chavi there. And it's Gerard, And here's Thierry Henry. What can he do? He's still going. Is that ours? It is going to be a corner. Gerard Whips it in. Ah, nobody to it. Chivu's still on the field here. And Thierry Marie. And, oh, it's off target. It's unbelievable. Never mind, it's unlucky. Well, apparently, for the first time ever, I have made a complete and utter mistake. I took Sergio Ramos off accidentally rather than Chivu. So Chivu has to play on for the rest of the game with an injury. I hope... It doesn't get any worse. I can't believe I've done that, to be honest. Oh, well. There's nothing we can do now. Hopefully, we can just see out this game. I think that was Joe Cole brought down there. Oh, let's cut out. And Casillas just booted back up somewhere. That's all right. And Reese is making the run ahead of Chavi. Well done. We've got to keep it going now. It's Reese's ball in. Oh, Terry Marie's going to chase it down. He'll get there first, will he? Oh, no, he won't. So, yeah. Poor Chivu. Poor Chivu. I'd, I've wondered why he was still on the field, and then I must have I've, uh, I've, I've realised I've made a mistake. I haven't brought him off. And that's all right. It's Joe Cole. Still Joel Cole, Thierry Henry, Mutu! Oh, would have finished the game off, it's stoppage time. It's Mutu. Oh, he, all he needed to do was play it into the corner, but he didn't do that. And it's Giannakopoulos. And it's still going here with Risa. We could still 
win this one. It's going to be the corner. Could still get a goal out of this one. Header! Oh, over the bar from Jokul. How did we not get a second goal in that? Oh, what a bit of a mess of a game, to be honest. It was a it was another lucky one, wasn't it? Just kind of like the Chelsea game a bit. Just a little bit. Well, what can you say about that? Mutu was the man of the match with a 7.5. It had to be him, really. I took Eto'o off because... He, he was all right, but he's he's not having a good time so far, is he? He's, a bit, he's struggling a bit. Xavi had the best game I think he's ever had. Um, maybe possibly Mafior too. He was excellent. Um, yeah, the guys at the back did their jobs really today. Um, Gerard had a really good game. I thought, I thought he was better than a six. Fabregas was good. Um, yeah, Joe Cole, Thierry and Rue were a bit unlucky not to do something there at the end. But, oh well good game so yeah just to confirm that chivu is going to be out for one week so he will miss the next game so here is the uh, results from fixture six guys to start us off fulham have beaten rangers one nil away from home arsenal have drawn two two with we united there uh pez united pick up their first win of the season against aston villa their first points actually in the league has taken them till fixture six to get it but that should move them up a, a few places i think that so so uh, it's not too bad for them. Aston Villa should be dead last again now, I think. Manchester United have lost at home to Everton. Wow. I didn't think that was going to happen today. I honestly did not, but that has helped us out quite a lot. Thank you, Everton. Newcastle win 4-0 at home to Tottenham. Chelsea win 4-0 away at Middlesbrough. And uh, West Brom, unfortunately, lost against Wigan 1-0 at home today. So they couldn't... Uh, you know, there, there, there was like, what, fourth in the league, I think, before today's game? So, uh, yeah, there we go. So, uh, West Brom have dropped down to eight. If they had won that game today against um, Wigan, they would have uh, stayed fourth. That would have been something. But they got ten points after uh, six league games. That's so not too bad. Arsenal up to second there. Manchester United down to third following that loss at home today to Everton. Chelsea up to fourth. Wigan up to fifth. Having an excellent season, Wigan. Uh, we United down to sixth. Newcastle into the top half now. We're on seventh position um everton up to ninth uh, there you go pez united pick up that win and move out of the relegation spots to 14 fast and villa still on only on the one point there they've let in 17 goals so far this season bolton moved down to 15th there um they did try pretty hardish against us today but uh, they've moved down back into a relegation spot so anyway guys here are the champions league qualifying groups so we're going to see who has gotten through and um, who hasn't gotten through. So yeah, Chelsea and Paris do go through there in their group. Um, Inter Milan, they were kind of close. Nine points. So, scored 12. Oh, that's unbelievable that they scored 12 along with Paris. They conceded one more than them. They won the same amount, lost the same amount, but they conceded. And that was the difference between sending Paris through and... Um, into out so yeah regina came bottom of that group so chelsea paris we got arsenal and aston villa right there who have gone through newcastle have had a pretty decent season in the league but aston villa have gone through in that group there psv were third in fact only eight points was at uh, the top in fact three teams got eight points there that's kind of unbelievable to be honest uh, arsenal drew five games and won one and came top of the group what aston villa drew uh two lost two and won two. Uh, PSV did the exact same. And Newcastle lost two, drew three, and won one. That's just insanity. That <laughs> that really is. So uh, yeah, we got AS Roma and Real Petit here. Um, so yeah, that's uh, not too bad. Uh, Marseille and Deportiva out there. And uh, Villarreal and Valencia through as well. So Udinese and Lyon crash out there. So we'll have a look at who we've got in the Champions League then. So this is the Champions League groups, guys. And as you can see there, uh, Juventus, Villarreal, AC Milan and Valencia are in a group together. So two Spanish and two um, Italian. Uh, just doesn't make sense. Two, we've got two English and two uh, Spanish there as well. We've got Barcelona, Real Madrid, Aston Villa and Arsenal. And then there's our group. We've got Manchester United in the group with us. That's unbelievable that. We've got AS Roma and Real Batiste. We had Roma last year, didn't we, in the group? So 
that's going to be interesting. And then the bottom one there, that, that's that's like the nice group at the bottom there. The nice mixture. We've got a French team, a Dutch team, a Portuguese team, and an English team. So we've got Ajax, Paris, Benfica, and Chelsea. So that is our group. Manchester United, AS Roma, and Real Batiste. So uh, yeah, that is quite something, but um, Europe isn't for a while yet. To start us off in fixture 7 in the league, we've got Bolton taking on Newcastle. Bolton need points. Aston Villa des desperately need points. They're taking on the new boys of West Brom there. So uh, we'll see how that one goes. We've got Wigan who are doing very well in the league. They're taking on Rangers. I put Wigan down for maybe a win there. They're doing really good. We United are at Middlesbrough. Middlesbrough not doing so good. So maybe go for a We United win there. It's like I'm betting on this now, you know. Uh, Chelsea and uh, Manchester United, that's a big game there. Hopefully we could probably do with a draw there, I think. Fulham and Spares, we got Everton against Pez United. Pez United want to keep that uh, form going if they can. And uh, we visit Highbury in the next one, guys, for Arsenal. A big game that one is going to be. So yes, got Chelsea and United there. And we uh, play at Arsenal. So, yeah, and we'll look forward to that one next time, guys. Pretty interesting week. We know who we've got in the Champions League. And I will see you next time. Comment, subscribe, and share as always. See you then. Take care.